And welcome back, guys, to Let's Play Mega Man 7. And we're in the middle of a cutscene. Welcome home, Mega Man! Dr. Light, what do you think of Bass? Bass. <laughs> I am fish. His actions don't seem to indicate a threat. I don't believe he is our enemy! How my hip! And then on screen, uh oh. What is this? Shit's getting torn up, folks. Harley is attacking the robot museum! You must leave now, Mega Man! I got it, Doctor! Fucking Mega Man 8's voice acting. <laughs> Alright, anyways, let's start the museum stage, which is actually a mix. The music is a mix of Guts Man's and another stage song from another Mega Man game. Whoever points it out gets a cookie. Zero's cookie stash, and then he cries. And, and in the background here, you can see other robots. You can see Snake Man, Blizzard Man, uh, Plant Man in the background there, um, Flame Man, friggin' Pharaoh Man, uh, and uh, Heat Man. He's right there, and alright, this boss is a pain in my ass. So That's let's try and get through this pain. really quick. Unfortunately, I have no energy tank, so this is gonna be tough. And Dr. Wily is stealing Gutsman. Gutsman, motherfucker! Ah, good. <laughs> I just failed my, uh, my HR quest, so. Was it, was it my fault? Was it Gutsman's fault? Was it Gutsman's fault? What didn't have Rainer Michael Jackson's kids? <laughs> uh, yes, it was. Oh man, I just got hit by that stupid fat fucking clown that's fatter than me. This is what I'm fighting right now. It is. Which is fucking hilarious. It's so fucking fat. It's like a jelly. It like. Its arms are jelly donuts. I am not that fat. I'm actually doing really well against this thing. I usually suck balls. Stop doing that noise. <laughs> All right, and he's defeated. There are reasons so. I don't like talking to you sometimes. All right, Th only oh, three heart. minutes through for the first part. All right, guys, we're doing making good time. I like to make good Anyways, another cutscene. Mega Man, it's a disaster. Wily and his robots are rampaging through the middle of the city. Oh no! <laughs> Get going! I don't have to listen to you, bitch. <laughs> But he's gonna do it anyways. Alright, anyways. And as you can see, oh my god! There's four more bosses. What do I do? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Actually, it's really easy. So we're gonna go ahead. We're gonna go ahead after Slash Man. Don't make me play that. Don't make me play that as an audio clip in the video. But, anyways, guys, this is Slash Man. Probably. One of the more annoying bosses, but I have his weakness, so... Or one of his weaknesses is too. Oh, no. You eat you eat it sometimes. Really? He will woke up surrounded by girls? Voice is number Oh man! Totally failed that. Wow. The, guys, I, I died again. This is pretty bad. <laughs> I know, it like never happens, man. You know, I'm gonna put my S Adapt on right here. I could use that so I don't fucking fail again. Like, I don't I don't die against in enemies. What the shitty fuck fuck? What the shitty fuck fuck fuck? That statement is redundant. Keep a hey, keep the property off my fuck. Oh, no, die now. Please. Get the pro it's get the property off my fuck, you fuck. No, but tell me to come on property. Keep the fuck off my property off my fuck. Anyways. Here's don't with the uh logistics of that fucking joke, please don't. This this stage is actually <laughs> Similar to a stage in Mega Man 4, but instead of grasshoppers, you have a fucking dinosaur that you have to sit on the back of. Instead of fucking frogs. I don't know what you're referencing. 
but I have a feeling it's stupid. Wait, there's something up there. <laughs> Is Nate, you just mad because you're gay? There was something I probably missed there, but uh, I'm, I'm not going to bother to go back and get it because there's a shit ton of spikes. I totally don't. I'm not, uh, at least, at least they can admit to being gay if they're gay. Not like you, nigga, because you're gay. Hold on, guys, I gotta go do the issues. Anyways. Alright, see you later, his name. I'm gonna be You're right still here gay. when I'm done, hat. Alright. Usually I don't fail so hard against the fucking T-Rex, but I'm not doing so hot now. Oh, and he's dead. Wow, that was a graphical glitch. What a digital dummy. Oh, that was stupid. Yes, it was. Anyways, let's, uh, let's bolt through this next part. Let's just use some junk shield, because I feel like I'm gonna fail if I don't. I think we can still hear Isnane singing in the background. I, I don't have the fire weapon, but if I did, I'd use it right here, because there's a secret there. But, uh... Dominican Rick Atsley. Oh, God. I don't even want to know. Wow, I'm getting all my health back. This is actually turning out pretty lucky. Never gonna give a taco up. Alright, well, I'm not probably gonna beat Slashman in this life, so I'm just gonna go in there and try and learn a strategy, but it's not gonna happen. Anyways, all right, Slash Man, let's see what you got, you slashy bitch. Oh shit, I might get through this entire game in one day. That'd be sweet, cause then my my LP fans would have something to watch. Yay! Not that I have a lot of those. I have more bridge fans, but then again, of course I didn't have more bridge fans. Okay, the strategy I usually use, which is going near the wall when the fucking things fall down, isn't working right now. It it works most of the time, and I just got owned on the first life. Well, but uh, yeah, this time I'm actually going to use his weakness. And I just noticed in the background it's X. Hinting at something? Hmm. Maybe another Mega Man game? I don't know. Unreal, you've been really quiet. Maybe he's not even there anymore. Anyways. you alive? Back to Slash Man. He's weak to both ice and fire, which is ironic. It, well, I think it's ironic, anyways. Anyways, here we go. I all I never dodge Slash Man's dash thing. I always get hit by it. His dash slash thing. So I don't even know why I bother dodging him. I'll have to take the hit. Oh, he didn't do it this time. Wow. I thought for sure he was going to do it because it does a shit ton of damage. You can get a free hit easy with it. Oh, I did it that time. Anyways, he is dead now. And that's another uh, Robot Master down. Another one bites the dust. Bam to da bam. I don't even know why I said that, but we're about nine minutes in. I could. I don't know if I should start another stage or, you know what, I probably could. But, uh,. Yeah, fuck it, I'll do it live. Um, fuck it! Uh, I got the Slash Claw, and I actually... You actually use this weapon quite a bit. Like, I use it a lot more than most people, but... I don't know. It, it'll be incredibly useful against the next boss we fight. But there we go, that's the Slash Claw, guys. So let's go ahead and move on to the next... To the next boss. I got about... Five minutes left. I think I can beat Springman stage in five minutes. This we'll see. If right not, here. we'll see what happens. I keep hitting call arms. Oh no. Anyways, Springman stage, and now there's another secret in here um, that I can get pretty easily. I'm gonna go ahead and switch to S Adapt because um, while it might be annoying to use sometimes in the stage, it is useful for getting around in the stage because there's springs everywhere in the stage. When you're trying to do a when, when you're trying to do a, a, a big jump, it does become annoying because, because you know, normally when you're trying to do a big jump, you're trying to hold down the jump button, but when you hold down the jump button, you use your jetpack. 
so it makes it a little difficult. Anyways, we'll get that free health right there. Thank you. Soap on a rope. Soap on a rope! Alright, and another free life! Wow! You love that song, don't you, Unreal? I'm actually not charging up my shot too much, just because, I don't know, I'm playing it like an old school man in the game. Which this kind of is, but it's not really me that's fashion, so I guess, I don't know. I actually really enjoy Mega Man 7. A lot of people don't, which kind of is like, because most people's reasons are, oh, it's 16-bit, so it's not classic anymore, or some shit like that. When the game came out, when the game came out, the two complaints that I heard about the most were um, the game's too hard because the because the controls aren't good and the uh, and because the uh, Mega Man's too big the, gra the graphics are too big and to that I say uh, controls are actually better than the previous games because they've, they've they programmed the buttons the same way they did to uh, Mega Man X so I don't know why people complain about the controls in this game. But, uh, the other thing about the character sprites being too big, they're honestly comparable, it's not that different. Anyways, this thing right here... You switch, it, you switch it the right way here. Uh, if I can switch it properly. What? Spring Man. Then stage. Anyway, here's where you get the Super Bowl. And this will unlock special extra items in the shop. And I just got and I just touched the spikes by accident. I might not get through this in the next three minutes, guys. It's probably not gonna happen. There's no way to you two. That's so fucking gay. Actually, I found that game really fun for the aspect of like how you got skills and shit. Whenever they started talking, I was like, that was the one moment where I just looked at my TV and I just felt like SCR just like wanting to put on eight different pairs of glasses and look at it. <laughs> Alright, so. Alright. Alright, well, I'm actually almost at Spring Man, but I don't think I have enough time to beat him, so I might have to stop at a boss. Drive. Actually, you know what? I probably could beat him, but, you know, I, I don't think a minute's gonna be enough for me to get all this footage, so. Next time, guys, on Let's Play Mega Man 7, I will take on Spring Man. See you later.